Sailor.org's computer skills and literacy course. You now have a handle on some of the basic terms and, com and concepts surrounding computers and their use. You're well on your way towards increasing your computer literacy skills. You have now toured the inside of a computer and learned the difference between computer hardware and computer software. By learning how computers work and by taking a closer look at the inner workings of the computer, you can better understand why specific programs are used to accomplish certain tasks. While this technical information is highly useful, we think you'll also find the common computer terminology that you learned especially important in reinforcing your prior learning and introducing new terms to you. In this unit titled, The Internet and the World Wide Web, we will begin by asking the question, what is the Internet? You will then learn everything you wanted to know about the Internet and then some. You will also view a video that will introduce you to the system that makes up the World Wide Web and will explain various terms, including browsers, code packets, servers, and links. This video provides you with an easy to grasp presentation of all of these computer concepts and how they work together. The next subsection introduces you to communicating with people through the internet. Communicating with people online has become increasingly popular. This section focuses on how you can communicate with others using the World Wide Web. You will take a look at screenshots or still pictures of computer screens in order to visually learn how to use email. The email explanations provide you with detailed steps and explanations that will make you confident in creating an email account for yourself and beginning to send and receive messages. While accessing the internet and its resources is exciting, it is important to learn how to be safe online. You will therefore learn about internet threats and how you can protect yourself online and surf the internet safely. If you aren't familiar with the term surf the web, this is a popular phrase used to describe browsing the internet or accessing various web pages online. Note that the section on internet security is crucially important. Please read it carefully and take notes. If you follow the advice offered by experts in their fields in this unit, you will find that you will be better able to navigate the World Wide Web and perform a variety of functions. The next unit, Unit 3, Computer Security and Troubleshooting, will offer you even more in-depth information on security, privacy, and information on troubleshooting techniques. I'll see you when you reach Unit 3. For now, enjoy exploring the Internet and the World Wide Web.